Coca-Cola's bold move. The beverage giant is set to invest a whopping US$1,387 crore for a new plant in Maharashtra, signaling a significant expansion in its operations. Economic Growth Forecast Chief Economic Advisor V. Anthony Jeswaran is optimistic about India's economic growth, foreseeing a robust momentum continuing into the December quarter with an estimated growth rate of 6.5% in the current fiscal year. U.S. jobless claims surge, the United States sees a notable spike in continued jobless claims, reaching the highest levels since late 2021, adding a layer of complexity to the global economic scenario. ITD Cementation's Big Win Securing a contract worth US 1,001 crore in Andhra Pradesh, ITD Cementation showcases its prowess in the construction sector. Whirlpool Strategic Move Whirlpool announces plans to sell a substantial 24% stake in its India unit, reshaping its portfolio in response to market dynamics. Tata Technologies Remarkable Day Achieving a market capitalization comparable to large cap companies, Tata Technologies Limited makes headlines with a premium listing of 140%, surging by an impressive 180% in a remarkable debut. Valuation insights on oil majors, analysts at Prabhudas Lilibhya highlight that Indian oil, BPCL, and HPCL are richly valued providing crucial insights for investors navigating the energy sector. HPCL's electric ambitions, Hindustan Petroleum reveals plans to double its presence in the electric vehicle market, aligning with the industry's shift towards sustainable practices. Tata Power's EV charging network, aiming to boost the electric vehicle infrastructure. A Tata Power Arm is set to install 12 EV charging stations across Konka, contributing to the country's green mobility goals. Tata Coffee's international expansion. Tata Coffee board green lights are 450 crore investment in its Vietnam subsidiary, marking a strategic move towards international growth. Fedbank Financial Services IPO debut. Shares of Fedbank Financial Services list at a 1.4% discount to the IPO price, capturing attention in the ever-evolving financial markets. Siemens Limited, the company has recommended a dividend of 10 rupees per share, payable from the 16th of February 2024. Bharat Petroleum Corporation Limited has declared an interim dividend of 21 rupees per share, with a payment date on or before the 28th of December. The record date for this dividend is set for the 12th of December 2023. Gujarat Namada Valley Fertilizers and Chemicals Limited. The company has announced a buyback price of 770 rupees per share through a tender offer, with the offer period starting on the 1st of December and closing on the 7th of December. Reju Engineers plans a buyback at a price of 210 rupees per share through the tender offer route. Safari Industries, India Limited. The company has fixed a record date for issuing bonus shares in the ratio of 1, 1 on the 12th of December 2023. M. Lak Hamzi Industries Limited, the company is set to consider the issue of bonus shares on the 2nd of December. ICICI Securities has received no objection letters from NSE and BSE for the proposed scheme of arrangement, focusing on the delisting of equity shares and the issuance of shares by ICICI Bank Limited. Ishwar Shakti Holdings and Traders Limited, the company is undergoing a composite scheme of arrangements with Six Area Industries Private Limited and Six Area Agritech Private Limited 
and 6 Area Finance Limited, in the ratio of 10, 1 and 7, 1, respectively. Sadhana Nitracham is proposing to raise funds through a right issue on the 2nd of December. Thanks for watching. Please thumbs up if you like, subscribe, press the bell icon and never miss an update, share and comment your thoughts on the comment section, and stay tuned with Corporate Actions India.